Chapter 8, Eto's Fever. All I'm saying is that guys just don't understand. Yeah, you do have a point. Ugh, men are so hard to live with. How do you think I feel? Sorry, hey, since now we're almost at my house, do you want to stop by for a short snack? Hmm, sure, why not? I'm home! Huh, it's quiet. Where's that to? Hmm, I don't know. A note? Let me see. Aiko, your father and I went to a meeting, so you'll watch Eto until we come back. Love, Mom. What fun! Uh, sis? Eto, did you have a nap? No. Something's wrong with him. Hi, sweetie. Can I feel your forehead for a minute? Sure. Eto, what's wrong with him? He's burning up. Take off his clothes now. All of them? Aiko? Okay, but Undy, stay on. So what's wrong with him? Your brother has a very, very high fever. You said very twice. Is that a bad thing? Yes. Oh, God. So? 102 degrees Fahrenheit, 38.9 Celsius. Oh, go run a cold bath for him, okay? Okay. What's happening? Good. You're conscious. You have a high fever. Oh. It's done. What's his temperature now? Open wide for me, Eto. 39.6 Celsius, 99.7 Fahrenheit. Okay, come on, Eto. You gotta go in the tub. No, I hate cold water. Sorry, sweetie, but it's for your own good. Masako. Uh, huh? What's his temperature now? 36.5.37.5 Celsius. That's good. You'll be fine, Eto. How did you know? Huh? About the fever. I used to get them all the time when I was little, so my brother always knew what to do. Oh, well, thank you. No problem. So how long do you think you'll be asleep for? I can't say. Maybe an hour? I think I'll stay up until Masako leaves. Oh, so you're awake, huh? How long were you faking to be asleep for? Actually, I was feeling better once I had the bath, but Masako was so warm when I rest my head on her lap. Who wouldn't want to get up? How about you go to your bed and let Masako and me chat for a while? No. Eto, I'm your big sister, so you better listen. No, I'm staying. Mm. How about this? I'll let you stay on my lap for five more minutes, and then it's off to bed for real this time. Okay, Masako. Oh, Masako, why do you have to be so good and make me look like the bad guy? I guess I'm just good with kids, I guess. You should be my sister, Masako. Why, you little... Ah! Masako, save me! Come on now, Aiko. He's only five. Ugh, you sound like my mom. And you won't be five forever. Our birthday is coming up in a few months. Hmm. Oh, when's your birthday? March 27th. I'm an Aries. When's yours? December 25th. Oh, so you're a Capricorn, and your birthday is on Christmas Day? How did that happen? I don't know. You'd have to ask my mom. I guess she only knows. Oh, I'm sorry. What was your mom like? Hmm. Well, I haven't seen her since I was six, so I can't recall what her face looks like. Almost blurred out, but I remember she had a warm, soothing, comforting voice. Beautiful white hair with green... no, blue eyes. I'm sure my brother has fond memories of her, too, since... He was with her longer before I came around. Well, she really does sound like a special mom. I hope I get to meet her one day. Me too. So, you're an Aries, huh? Mm-hmm. I'm a fire sign, and yours is an earth sign. I see. Well, I don't know much about astrology, so you're gonna have to teach me. Hey, want to know what both of our signs have in common? Hmm. What? They both have horns, so if anyone messes with us at school, we can give them the horns. <laughs> Well, that is true. Yeah. Hey, can I ask you a personal question? Hmm? Sure. What? It's about that guy, Kyuji. Is he really your boyfriend? Hmm, no. I mean, I thought about giving dating a try, but I don't like it, so I never really saw him as a lover, really. And honestly, my dad works for his dad, so it was kind of a setup. So you had no choice but to date him? Kinda. His dad is rich, so my dad told me to date him. I gave it a shot to try to make my dad feel proud of me for once, but all he cares about is the money and not my happiness. 
Well, I think you should choose who you want to date, not him. You're an amazing girl, and any guy would be so lucky to have you as their partner. Uh, sorry, I, uh, didn't mean to go that deep. No, it's fine. And you're right about it. Do you have a crush on any of the guys at school? Uh, I, no, but this one guy named Toby in my class has a crush on me, but I only like him as a friend. How about you? Nobody better have a crush on my Masako. Eto, go to sleep. Okay, sorry about that. You were saying? Uh, no, I don't have a crush on any of the guys at school. I don't really want to date. Why not? Because I'm afraid I'll end up with a guy just like my mom. I see. Well, I'm sure you'll find a nice guy, get married, and have lots of kids. Huh, yeah? Sure. You're really good with kids, so why not? Eto seems to really like you. I see. Well, I should get going. Aw, has it been five minutes already? I'm afraid so. Thanks again for helping me. No problem. If anything happens, call me, okay? I will. Bye. Bye, and rest well, Eto. Bye. Sis, I'm feeling better. Can I have ice cream? And back to my normal life.